on the fastest way to get Windows 11 is to download it yourself from Microsoft. This is much, much faster than waiting for a Windows update. Now the first thing you want to do is use the PC Health Checker from Microsoft to see if your PC can run Windows 11 to see if it is compatible with it. And I'm going to have a link to that app and other apps that are similar to it in the video description. Alright, so now after using the PC Health Check app to see if your PC can run Windows 11, go ahead and go to Microsoft Windows 11 downloaded page, which I have a link to that in the video description as well. Great, so now this is the page that allows you to download and upgrade your computer to Windows 11. Now on the download page, you are going to see three options. The easiest one to choose is the Windows 11 installation assistant because this one, Microsoft does all the work for you. Now in a different video, we are going to consider the other options such as creating a bootable Windows 11 installation USB. And now that's it, go ahead, download and run the Windows 11 installation assistant and this will begin installing Windows 11 for you. Now this process, let's see, depending on your PC, it may take about 45 minutes to get done. It's a three step process, the first one, uh, it's going to download it for you. The second one is going to verify the download to make sure everything's okay. And then the third step, it's going to actually install Windows 11. And remember, you can also use Windows Update to upgrade to Windows 11. Mind you, this is a much lower process to get it. And to do that, all you have to do is click Start and then type Updates and then select Check for Updates in your search results. And then this will open up Windows Update. And then from that point, you can click check for updates. And now if your PC is compatible with Windows 11, it's going to tell you that, okay, wow, this update is there, but you may not get it yet. So this is why using Microsoft download page is the best way to upgrade your computer to Windows 11. So there you go. In just about two minutes, you learn how to quickly do this. For more videos that are simple and straight to the point, please subscribe and Thanks for watching.